Good day, everyone, and welcome to another learning opportunity here on Lessons Made Easy. I am Teacher Bell, and in this video, we are going to learn about quadrilaterals and their properties. The term quadri means four. This refers to the figures with four sides and four angles, or what we call quadrilaterals. Let's take a closer look at this given example. This figure has four sides and four angles. Therefore, we call this a quadrilateral. Let's take a closer look at the types of quadrilaterals and their properties. Let's begin with a parallelogram. Notice that opposite sides of a parallelogram are parallel. You can clearly see that side AB is parallel to side CD, and side AC is also parallel to side BD. Now, looking at the angles, we can say that opposite angles are equal. Angle A is equal to angle D, while angle B is equal to angle C. Let's move on to the rectangle. Just like the parallelogram, a rectangle has two pairs of opposite sides that are equal and parallel. It is obvious that side AB is parallel and equal to side CD. The same goes with side AC, which is also parallel and equal to side BD. What is special about a rectangle is that all its angles are the same. Each angle is a right angle, with a measurement of 90 degrees. Moving on to another type of quadrilateral, which is the rhombus. The rhombus is very similar to a square. Just like a square, all four sides of a rhombus are equal and the opposite sides are parallel. Notice in this figure that side AB is parallel to side CD. Side AC is also parallel to side BD. Now take a look at the angles. If you notice, opposite angles are equal as well. Angle A is equal to angle D, and angle B is equal to angle C. One of the very common type of a quadrilateral that you can see almost everywhere is the square. Just like a rhombus, a square has four equal sides. Opposite sides are parallel. As you can see in the given figure, side AB is parallel to side CD. Another pair, we have side AC that is parallel to side BD. All the four angles of a square are equal. They are all right angles with a measurement of 90 degrees. Let's take a look at the kite. A kite is a quadrilateral in which two pairs of consecutive sides are equal. In the given figure, Side AB is equal to side CB. Another pair is side DA and side DC. These two sides are also equal. However, none of the sides are parallel, and we can't find any right angles either, although one pair of opposite angles is equal, that is, angle A and angle C. Another type of a quadrilateral is the trapezoid, also known as trapezium. In this trapezoid, we can't find sides of the same length nor angles of the same size. But one thing that's clear is one pair of opposite sides is parallel. Can you guess which sides are parallel? Well then, in this figure, Side AB is parallel to side CD. And finally, down to our last figure, 
we call it an irregular quadrilateral. It is called an irregular quadrilateral because none of the sides are equal, none of the angles are the same, and none of the sides are parallel either. All the sides have different lengths. Here are some points to remember about quadrilaterals. Quadrilaterals are simple closed figures with many sides, so we also call them polygons. Quadrilaterals are polygons with four sides and four angles, and the sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral is always 360 degrees. Before we finally end our lesson, let's have a simple quiz. You'll get to choose the correct answer. You may not need a paper for this because the answer will be revealed to you right after. Are you ready? So here we go for the first question. Which figure has four equal sides, four right angles, and opposite sides are parallel? Your choices. Is it a parallelogram, a square, or a trapezoid? Correct answer is a square. Let's take a look at this question. How many sides and how many angles does a quadrilateral have? Is it four sides and one angle? Is it four sides and four angles? Or four sides and three angles? What do you think? The correct answer is four sides and four angles. What about this question? How many equal sides does an irregular quadrilateral have? Is it four, three, or none? What do you think? Correct answer is none. In an irregular quadrilateral, no sides are equal. Let's try another question. What is the sum of the interior angles of a quadrilateral? Here are your choices. Is it 90 degrees? Is it 180 degrees? Or is it 360 degrees? What do you think? For the correct answer, it is 360 degrees. Down to our last question. Which figure is an example of a quadrilateral? Is it a circle, a rectangle, or a triangle? For the correct answer, rectangle. Were you able to answer all five questions correctly? If yes, then congratulations! And that would be all for this lesson. And if you find this video useful, hit the like button and share to people you know, for this may also be helpful for them. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel for more educational videos only here on Lessons Made Easy. Once again, this is Teacher Bell saying thanks for watching, stay safe, and see you again in our next lesson.